Hey guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. Today is Sunday, October the 2nd. And today is the first day of Podcasters Spirit Week. We should have some pom-poms. <laughs> but, um, so this is hosted by Llama Mama Kayla. She does all the fun things, I swear. <laughs> but, uh, she's invited anyone to join along. So I thought I would. And this is the only hat I have, but it's adorable. It's technically a headband, but we won't get into that. <laughs> And it's a witch hat. I bought this at the Dollar General <laughs> to wear during Vlogtober videos. And then she announced that. And I was like, that's perfect. <laughs> but uh, it's a little witch hat. And it's adorable. I love it. <laughs> I, of course, I have a million crochet hats. But they're in the closet. Because I live in Tennessee. We don't pull those out until December. <laughs> Maybe November if we're lucky and it gets cold. But we've had Christmases in the 70s. So maybe December. <laughs> Anyways, I wanted to show my spirit week this my spirit whatever <laughs> and come on here with my hat on <laughs> and also um i'll link llama mama kayla down below if you don't know who she is but i'm pretty sure everybody knows who she is by now <laughs> but i also wanted to share with you my scarf i actually finished this last thursday it was uh the 28th i think of september because i was trying to get it done in september so it would count as a september finished object <laughs> but i finished it so this is a free uh, video tutorial by pamela's adoring crochet i like her channel as well amazing woman again <laughs> and it's a free tutorial I used um, mandala ombre which is a worsted weight acrylic in the colorway mantra this is how much I got left of the second cake I used um, some of one cake for a headband air warmer and then I put the rest of that cake in the scarf and then I opened this cake to put there in the scarf and this is what I got left so I'm gonna make a hat I think out of that it should be enough to make a hat a beanie or something um, so I use a H hook, which is a five millimeter, and this is my scarf. So this is where the first cake started. It's light blue, and I'd already woven my ends, so I don't. It's somewhere around here, I think, is where it ended. I think it was like green color. Do 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 do. It just keeps going <laughs> to the end. So this is about the size of my wingspan, which I think is what you're supposed to do for scarves. Make them the person's wingspan, which is their height. One. So it's probably a little bit longer. So it's it's at least 64 inches because I'm 5'7". So um, 67 inches, right? Yeah. <laughs> uh, but it's a little bit, see it's drooping, so it's a little bit longer than that. But it's beautiful and I love it. And I'm going to wear it whenever it gets cold. So I probably won't get to wear it until, I mean, if we're lucky, it'll start getting chilly. Maybe in November. Enough to need a scarf. But probably like more towards the end of December and definitely January and February next year because... That's our coldest time is January through March usually. Um, but who knows? According to the um, persimmon, is it the persimmon? Uh, we got the the knife, which means that it's supposed to be really cold. Um, uh, winter, it's supposed to cut like a knife, you know, the, you know, it's supposed to be super cold. <laughs> but we got the shovel last year and we only got a little bit of snow, so I don't know how reliable that is. But <laughs> anyways, this is my beautiful scarf. I love it. I love bubble stitches. And I've done so many in September because my Halloween countdown was all stitches and then this. But this was a lot easier. And this pattern was super easy to repeat. It is a five row repeat. Nope, six row. You do uh, five rows of this little cluster stitch. And then you do the bubble and then you just start all over again. And it was uh, easy. I did make mine a little bit wider than hers. Hers, uh, she chained, I think, 24. And I chained 30-something. <laughs> I don't remember how many. But, um... I just think it's cute. I love it. I can't wait to wear it. I love blues and greens together. I like blues a lot because I have blue eyes. So I think, I feel like it makes my eyes look more blue. <laughs> but, um, and I'm wearing a blue shirt. I just, I, love, I tend to like blue, I guess. <laughs> but, um, I love it. And thank you, Pamela, for writing this beautiful pattern and sharing it for free for all of us to check out. So I'm going to leave her link below and I'll leave Lava Mama Kayla down below too. And, uh, now I've got to find a hat pattern to make with this. I think um, there's plenty enough here to make a hat and they probably have a scrap ball left over. But I also saw that a bunch of other uh, podcasters are doing the Spirit Week. And this morning I watched uh, Cinnamon Stitches did it. I watched somebody else, but now I can't remember who it is. I'm trying to watch a lot of videos every day because now Vlogtober started. So many people are doing it, including myself, that if you don't keep up with it, you can get behind so quickly. And especially people like Heather. <laughs> no offense, Heather. I love you, Heather. But uh, the Crochet Witch. Her videos are always really long. So uh, even in two times speed, they're still like 30 minutes long. Um, so I usually watch her videos while I'm doing stuff in the kitchen, like cooking or washing bottles and dishes and stuff. Uh, 
because it just takes me a while to do all that and then I can listen to her and watch her <laughs> in between all that. But anyways, June is napping so I'm going to go in there and start a new crochet project and it's a Christmas project but it's not Christmas themed. It's a Christmas gift. So I'm going to get that started and um, and then I'm going to vlog throughout the day. So I'll see you guys tomorrow for Vlogtober Day 3 and also Spirit Week Day 2. <laughs> so um, yeah, I guess that's it. I don't know what else to say. <laughs> but uh, check out this pattern if you want to. It's super easy, super quick. And it's easy to change the size of it. But anyways, I'm going to hop off here and I'll see you guys in the video. Bye guys. Thank you.